Good morning. So it's about 7 a.m. Uh, it's a really, really late wake up for me. My son has his first basketball game for the season and um, actually since COVID started, he hasn't played uh, since March. So um, he was really nervous and unable to sleep last night. So um, he came in my bed and um, finally was able to get to sleep around 2.30 this morning. So um, I had to turn off my early alarms and set them a little bit later. So uh, we're up, we're getting dressed and getting ready to head to um, his game. Okay, so I'm actually on my way to uh, my son's basketball game. Uh, it's at the local YMCA. He's riding with his dad um, because when I leave, uh, I gotta run some errands. So he's gonna head home after the game. Uh, he's been on the basketball league at the YMCA since he was four years old. So this is his sixth year playing um, at the Y. The YMCA is honoring the memory of a local teen, Bradley Hewlett, who was fatally shot last December at the age of 15 by placing his initial and uh, basketball number on the back of uh, the jerseys this year. So after the game, they had their post-game huddle, and since today happens to be Halloween, they also got a goodie bag from their coach filled with um, some awesome treats. Alright, tell me about that game. I played good, did layups, I shot threes, I didn't make them, but... But good job. I'm so proud of you, buddy. Thank you. Alright. What was the score? The score was 20 to 6. I scored 14 points and some good assists. Very good. Eric, so I am so proud of him considering he didn't get a lot of sleep last night. Um, he's headed out with his dad and I am going to run a few errands. My first stop is the grocery store. I have to pick up a few things because later on this afternoon, we'll be celebrating with my sister for her 50th birthday party. Although I don't particularly like going grocery shopping, by far my favorite location in the grocery store is the produce department. I really enjoy looking at all of the fruit and vegetables, the different colors, the fragrance, the flavors. Uh, it's really, really stimulating. Growing up, we had a tiny banana tree that had bananas that looked like these. A lot of these fruits and vegetables are nostalgic for me. Growing up in a Caribbean home, I've tasted most, if not all of these fruits and vegetables. I can make a mean butternut squash soup. If you haven't already, check out my video where I did uh, spaghetti squash. I'll post the link in the description. My next stop was to get some succulent. My sister loves succulents. She didn't tell me whether she wanted real ones or fake ones, so I got both. Hopefully she'll like it. So we're just arriving at my sister's for her party. It's a Gatsby theme party and I'm ready to celebrate with her. So we're early to the party.
Healthy and fabulous. Woohoo! Yes, I 